thought that Footsteps was a really moving documentary about the journey that Delago and his uh, partner in this adventure, Izzy, go through to uh, shoot their performance, their music performance on the top of the Delago mountain peak. Um, even though their journey doesn't end the way they want it to, it's just seeing all everything that it took to get there from birthing a baby to intense knee surgery and re rehabilitation, um, and just learning all about ancestors and following in the footsteps of the people that went before them, and also creating a trail for those who've come after them. I thought the message of that was really powerful. The way this film was shot was really beautiful. Um, there were some really gorgeous mountain shots in the beginning when we get to see a lot of Delago's previous performances on top of these gorgeous locations. Uh, I think he captured those really, really well. Um, and yes, um, also there was a little message in there about the impact of human interference on these beautiful mountains and these peaks, which left a bitter aftertaste in Delago's, um, for, for, for Delago and also I think for us as the audience, sort of seeing the impact that that had on his Delago peak um, was disheartening and sad to see, especially when they prevented him from shooting his beautiful performance on top due to the possibility of human interference when there was all this construction going on anyway. Um, it was a little ironic and sad to see, but overall I thought it was a really powerful documentary about their journey. Um, so yeah, I really enjoyed this, this film. Footsteps is a really beautiful and interesting documentary. Um, I love the, the footage and the music and the reflections. It's, it really takes you along for the journey. All right, I just finished watching um, Footsteps, which I, I'm actually, I really enjoyed. I thought this was a really well done piece in terms of cinematography. Obviously, um, all the natural settings and backdrops are um, quite beautiful and worked well and matching with the musical approach. But I thought that the piece sort of took on a, a documentary narrative approach that I thought was um, quite interesting, especially when um, the um, female subject's um, pregnancy comes up and how she's going to deal with it and how they're going to deal with um, shifting dynamics of being creative and uh, giving, giving birth, raising the child um, tried to express themselves in performance. I thought there was a really sort of blended approach in terms of um, spirituality that I thought was uh, very strong within the piece and sort of matched thematically with the spirit with the um, uh, natural uh, backdrop and aesthetic and uh, sort of a very life of life and death cycle type of vibe that I thought was really um, meditative and um, spiritual and worked well in creating a sense of mood that was um, very engaging. So I thought the piece was uh, well done. Um, I ended up enjoying it. And I thought the music was um, really cool and. Um, very vibey, which uh, I tend to enjoy. So it was a um, well done uh, piece overall for me. I really liked Footsteps. Um, it was a, it's very interesting learning more about artists, but also about music and instruments themselves. And the pan drum is a very calming and serene instrument. Uh, I loved learning more about. Uh, the artist's fascination with it and just creating this band, uh, learning more about this passion project between the two of them and the trials and tribulations that came towards um, coming together to make this, all while uh, interchangeably splicing between the footstep song. It was, it was a very enjoyable experience and I'm very glad to have watched it. Footsteps was absolutely wonderful. Um, I loved the whole story and saga of trying to make this project come to life. And so much of it was so serendipitous from finding the mountain to finding each other as the, as these two musicians who um, can perform, but also climb. And they encountered so many bumps along the way and so many drawbacks and, um, I think I was also so disappointed when I found out that they couldn't film. Um, but I almost felt a little bit better. And it sounds like he did too, when he got there and there was so much construction that like they wouldn't have been able to do it anyways. Um, so 
I'm happy that they climbed it anyways. And I was curious because when they were actually performing the song, I was like, but this isn't on top of a mountain. So what, what's going on? Um, but I thought the whole journey was just beautiful and fascinating. There was so much, um, to take away from it. And, um, also the song is beautiful. Her voice is stunning. Um, it was like, I kept like waiting for, for more of the performance to come in because it was just her, her voice just kind of takes you places. It was so ethereal and beautiful. So I really, really enjoyed this piece and it was very well done. Footsteps. Well, this musical documentary had a nice intro, beautiful cinematography, and it really set up what the story would tell us or take us to. The music outdoors is a wonderful concept, I think, as long as it doesn't disturb animals and nature. And they were really respectful of this. And ultimately their concerns were with not interrupting the environment. That cool handpan instrument that our filmmaker uh, played, it was nice to see him in real footage of actually playing this in concerts and that gorgeous sound it makes. It's much like the Caribbean steel drum sound. That was intriguing. Uh, what an amazing journey that himself and the singer Isabel went on. And despite not being able to perform on the mountain tower, you know, he said it was still meaningful and how true that was. It was a great film to watch and it just made me kind of look forward to hopefully going now to more outdoor concerts held in the summer, especially it made me miss those.